all right here's something i did the other day i did a, a new air ride leveler valve i put this on i didn't put it on the internet because i was about out of data but let me show you how to do this all right you take this and this is your inline right here this is a kenworth w900 uh, 05 this is your inline here's an outline that goes to the airbag on the bottom is another outline that goes to the airbag. Uh, here's your dump valve. This here is the leveling arm. And here's your rod that goes down to the, the cross member. Alright, so what you do is, once you get all this hooked up, you have to measure your air ride height. Now on your rear end, the rear rear end not the front rear end on the rear rear end you have a line there's a line that goes along this front the front of the axle let me see if i put phone down there uh, there's that line all right now if you'll notice the rear end tilts backwards it doesn't it doesn't sit straight it tilts backwards and kind of goes up on an angle so that line is your center point that's going to be in line with your drive shaft and you want this to all be measured out properly so what you do is you take take your handy dandy measuring tape here i'm going to try and do this with one hand all right and you measure from that line to the frame now on my truck, on the W9, Kenworth, with the AG380 suspension on Kenworth W9, it's eight and a half inches. So if I put this on this line right here, eh, somewhere around here, and go up to the frame, you'll see it's at eight and a half inches. That's fully, fully raised. Now to adjust it, you're going to take... You, you move this up and down until you get the right height, until you get eight and a half inches. Once you get eight and a half inches, you want to center it out. And there's a hole right here. Uh, there's a hole right here. This goes through to the back side and goes into here. You just run a pin through there to straighten it out. And that'll, you know, that keeps that level. It won't go nowhere because it doesn't do anything when this is straight. And then once that's straight, you take this rod here and you adjust this rod to be the right height. So now once you're all done, this will sit straight across. This rod won't be bent or anything, won't have any tension. And you'll be at eight and a half inches. Then you remove your pin and go inside and check your airlines. You know, you want to make sure none of this is leaking or anything. This is in layman's terms. I've been all over the internet trying to find information about all kinds of things. And really, it's hard to find shit in layman's terms. It's just everybody wants to be so damn technical about everything. And you get PDF files and everything else. Simple way to figure it out. So I just thought I'd show you that.